deployed Texas military husband watches wife give birth on Skype, he was right there. Although Brooklo Farmer's husband wasn't there for the birth of their daughter, Emmeline, she never felt alone. Despite Captain Michael Lowe Farmer's deployment, he was present for his family on video chat during his wife's entire pregnancy, including when she gave birth in November. The couple are also parents to two-year-old Aubrey and 12-month-old Clark, who they adopted during Michael's deployment. He was right there, Brooke told KSFY. That's just a very amazing thing for a military spouse to know that I had his support all the way overseas and the doctors allowed that to happen by letting him Skype in to see our child be born. Brooke says her doctors even allowed her husband to video chat during all of her ultrasounds. Doctors, actually let me take my iPad into every visit, every ultrasound and talk to him like he was just right there in the room, hey dad, how's it going? How's the weather over there? He just let him be a part of every visit and it was an amazing experience from that first ultrasound all the way through, Brooke told KSFY. And when it came time to deliver Emmeline, her ob slash gin, Dr. Molly Ewing, helped set up her laptop. I kind of tried to be a little bit of a girlfriend slash doctor for her so that she didn't feel all alone, Dr. Molly Ewing told KSFY. We had him on Skype on a laptop. And so we had this table set up over her knee so he could kind of see her. And so then we had our little resident doctor basically, like scrubbed out essentially, and was holding the laptop on my shoulder. As I was delivering the baby, the computer was around and all the angles and he got a great view. I think he even saw the baby before Brooke even did on Skype abroad. Emmeline was born on November 21st with a cleft lip and a small cleft in the alveolar arch where the teeth come in and required corrective surgery shortly after birth. She was treated by Dr. Barry Martin of Avera Medical Group Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery. I think Avera, every step of my pregnancy, every step of this journey, they have gone above and beyond. They just made us feel special and made us feel welcome and knew that Michael was going to be included in her birth, Brooke told KSFY. Michael returned home in February and the family has been spending as much time together as possible in their Texas home. We're just excited to get our family started, Brooke told KXXV. Michael is, a great, soldier and dad.